Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can reset your Windows operating system and prepare it for a sale or if you want to give this PC to somebody else and if you want to reset your Windows operating system and wipe out every uh, file which you uh, have on your Windows operating system so you can uh, give it to a new user uh, and new user will get this Windows operating system in the newest form without any software or anything so let's see how we can uh, do this so for that what you need to do is you just need to click on your windows icon here windows start icon and then go to settings and once this setting uh, window opens you just need to click on the update and security option and once this window opens you just need to click on the recovery uh, option here now you can see uh, two options one is uh, the reset this pc option and other is advanced startup option we are interested in the resetting of our pc so we will proceed with the first uh, option right now it will not harm you to uh, read everything before going ahead so it says if your pc isn't running well resetting it might help this lets you choose to keep your personal file or remove them and then reinstalls uh, windows okay so let's uh, click on this get started button now here you have two options so if you want to uh, use your pc after the resetting then you might want to choose the first option but this uh, video is for the resetting of our pc to give somebody else so we might want to uh, uh, remove everything all the files and apps and reset uh, it to a newest form so i am going to choose uh, this option remove all the files and now it's going to uh, give us this options now as i said if you want to uh, keep your pc you can go back uh, to the previous step and choose uh, all these options again but i have chosen the remove everything because i want to give this pc to somebody else and now in the next step, I see the current settings option here. Just remove your files. This is quicker but less secure. Remove all files only from the drive where Windows is installed. Okay. So I'm going to choose the settings from here. You can see data eraser. Just remove your files. This is a quicker but less secure option. And the second option is remove all the files only from the drive where windows is installed so definitely uh, we are going to choose uh, this option because we want to make sure that everything is uh, secure and safe so i'm going to choose uh, this option and you can choose this option also so both options you can choose at the same time and at this point also if you don't feel uh, like resetting your pc or if you don't want to give your pc to uh, somebody else then you can cancel this process so this is the last step before we start the process of resetting so hopefully you have backed up all the data which you uh, want to back up into a hard drive or somewhere else and if you want to get help you can uh, click on this button also so for now i'm going to just click on the confirm button and then i see uh, this uh, window which says remove files and clean the drive this may take hours but will uh, make harder to recover files other option is remove all files from all drives and also you can see it says show me uh, the list of uh, drives which will be affected so i can click on this option and uh, i can see uh, the drives which will be affected by this reset so i have created this f drive manually so uh, after the reset this drive will be uh, deleted or uh, cleaned at least so i'm okay with it so i will go ahead with it at this point also you can change the settings which you have chosen and if you are happy with those settings just click on confirm and then click on next and now on the next window i can see uh, ready to reset this pc resetting will remove all the personal files and user accounts on your pc remove any changes made to the settings and remove all the apps and programs this will take a while and restart your pc so at this point just make sure that your pc or laptop is connected to a power supply because it will be restarted 
uh, several number of times and it, it can take few hours to reset your PC. So once you have made sure everything is okay, just click on the reset button which is going to uh, prepare this PC for the reset and then it's going to restart several times. So at this point you don't need to do anything, just leave your PC on a table and uh, you can do something else. Everything will happen automatically until you see a start window. And now I can see that my Windows operating system has been restarted and now Windows is preparing for the reset. So now at this point my Windows is factory resetted. So at this point I can just switch off my laptop power and then uh, just give this to uh, the new user uh, for uh, his use right so whenever he will uh, start this PC he will see this kind of window where he can choose the country for example and then he will be able to uh, choose uh, the keyboard layout so he will uh, give his credentials to this windows operating system because it's uh, now totally resetted and he will give his preferences like keyboards and languages and uh, other preferences according to uh, his tastes. So this is how you can factory reset your Windows operating system and then give uh, this PC to somebody else who wants to use it. For example, if you want to sell it or donate this uh, Windows 10 operating system. So I hope you've enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next video.